Emily in Paris has made us fall in love with the city, the fashion, and yes, even the guys. But there's one character that stood out above the rest. Crazy. It's crazy, but it's, it's nice and it's kind of sexy, but and uh, Doug? Emily's hot new chef neighbor, Gabriel, stole our hearts when he first opened his apartment door and accidentally met Emily. This was my apartment fifth floor. This is the fourth floor. Fifth floor. Right. Throughout the season, Emily and Gabriel's relationship gets tricky, and we definitely can't get enough. While we'll have to wait a bit longer to find out what happens to him in season two, that doesn't mean we can't talk about everything we know about him now. So who is he? And who is the actor that plays him? Here in Paris. Just a few things from home I can't live without. Major spoilers for season one of Emily in Paris below. Here's everything you need to know about Gabriel from Emily in Paris. What's Gabriel's story? Gabriel is Emily's neighbor who lives right below her new apartment in Paris. Um, it's soap. Uh, see, that's yeah. the secret to Rome. It's we never clean. We. They meet after she accidentally tries to enter his apartment one night. When she does it again in the second episode, welcome to bang anytime on his door. Gabriel and Emily start to grow closer as he helps her translate with their landlord, and she has to use to his shower in the meantime. After Emily has a terrible night out, Gabriel admits that he likes her, which makes her realize she likes him back. In episode 4, Gabriel cooks breakfast for Emily, and she discovers more about his work as a chef at a nearby restaurant. When she is unable to get reservations for a special dinner, Emily asks him to squeeze in her group, and he impresses them with his skills. That's your new friend Gabriel. Yes. Mm -hmm. While this is all happening, Emily also lies to Sylvie and pretends that the lingerie that she received from Antoine was from Gabriel. No, it was above and beyond. You made me look great out here. Well, it's not a hard thing to do. After the dinner, Sylvie pushes Emily to go after Gabriel and the two share a kiss. Did you forget something? I did. However, soon after, Emily discovers that Gabriel actually is taken and is currently in a relationship with her new BFF Camille. Emily questions Gabriel while checking out a museum with Camille, starting a three-way friendship with them. After she gets drunk one night, Gabriel admits that he felt something during their kiss, which further complicates their relationship. His relationship with Camille also starts to unravel after she tries to get him to accept her parents' offer to buy him a restaurant. Gabriel helps Emily find a missing watch, and he invites her to watch the sunrise with him, but she admits that she wants more out of their relationship. Things get even more awkward when Camille invites Emily out to visit her family, and Gabriel comes too. Emily sleeps with Camille's brother in order to get over him, but it causes Gabriel to show more of his jealousy. It is needlessly confusing. Bonjour, mon American. Mm. Oh. After Emily starts a new relationship with Matthew, he decides to buy a new restaurant in Normandy and leave Paris. In his last night in the city, Emily and Gabriel finally spend the night together as a goodbye, finally letting themselves be with one another. However, the next morning, Emily discovers that Antoine bought the restaurant that Gabriel worked in so he can stay in Paris, and she soon receives a text from Camille, saying she wants to talk to her about Gabriel staying. Hi. Hi. Um, I brought you a going away present. I think I'm supposed to get you one of those. Oh, uh, right. Well, I thought you might like to have this. Who plays him? French actor Lucas Bravo plays Gabriel in Emily in Paris. This is his first starring television role. Oh, don't worry, you can keep the omelette pan. I'll go get another glass. Hope you liked that video and if you haven't subscribed this channel, do subscribe it and we will see you in the next video.